वरम अस्सलाम वालेकुम वेलकम टू माय चैनल एम आसिफ मैथ कॉर्नर टुडे इंशाल्लाह वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट कैलेटिव एंड क्लाइन फोर ग्रुप वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक ऑफ ग्रुप थ्योरी सो लेट्स स्टार्ट कैलेटिव व्हाट इज कैलेटिव कैले वाज अ साइंटिस्ट ब्रिटिश साइंटिस्ट एंड इन 19th सेंचुरी ही मत डू ही मच वर्क अबाउट ही हैज डन टू मच वर्क अबाउट द ग्रुप थ्योरी एंड अलजेब्रा एटसेट्रा मेनी मोर ब्रांचेस ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स ही इज वाज अ ग्रेट मैथमेटिशियन सो व्हाट इज कैले टेबल इट इज ऑफन कन्वीनिएंट टू डिस्क्राइब अ ग्रुप इन टर्म्स ऑफ एडिशन एंड मल्टीप्लिकेशन टेबल we often make often make a table to easy understand the group either it is a group either it is a symmetric group either it is an abelian group so the kale table is very a convenient way to understand the groups for example let's take a group g is equal to 1 minus 1 iota and minus iota be a group under the multiplication so let's see the table which type of table uh, the kale table is uh, can be found by this group the g is equal to 1 minus 1 iota and minus iota we have discussed this group uh, in my previous lectures as well so let's start let's make the table what is kale table the kale table is in kale table actually we discuss the closure law either it is the close or not every element when multiply with other elements and itself as well what are the answers either those answers are uh, do belong with the group or not so let's start here is this is the sign of multiplication in the row we write all elements 1 minus 1 iota and minus iota and in the column as well minus 1 One, sorry, minus one, iota and minus iota. When we multiply this one to this one, the answer is one. One multiply by one, the answer is one. When this one multiply by this minus one, the answer is minus one. When this one multiply with iota, then the answer is iota. And when this one multiply by this minus iota. the answer is minus iota here one is the identity when any element multiply with identity that remains its identity i mean to say that when any element multiply with identity then the answer will be the same that element now the second row we check when minus 1 multiply by 1 the answer is minus 1 similarly when minus 1 multiply by minus 1 minus 1 into minus 1 plus 1 answer is plus 1 when minus 1 multiply by iota then answer is minus iota when minus 1 multiply by minus iota then minus minus both sign become plus and iota into 1 answer is iota similarly when iota multiply by 1 the answer is iota then when iota multiply by minus 1 the answer is minus iota when iota multiply by iota to so iota square we note that iota square is equal to minus 1 and one when iota multiply by minus iota the answer is minus 1 into uh, minus become plus 1 so when minus iota multiply by 1 the answer is minus iota when minus iota multiply by 1 minus minus cancel and iota ones are iota when minus iota multiply by iota then iota square minus 1 and this minus become it plus 1 and minus 1 multiply by minus iota minus minus cancel iota square is equal to minus 1 in this way we make many uh, the tables of many groups and these type of tables are called kale tables
so our next topic is line 4 group very important group in the group theory so lines 4 line uh, felix line was a scientist a mathematician in 1884 he introduced the klein 4 group the klein 4 group is a group with four elements in each element is self inverse which each element is self self inverse what it mean when self inverse means when one multiply by for example one the answer is one when any element multiply by itself it give us identity in other words the order of every non identity element is two let's understand here it is denoted by letter v or k4 in subscript 4 is in subscript is given by k4 is equal to e a comma b comma c these are four elements in this group and uh, as discussed earlier that the self these are self inverse uh, elements so when a multiply by a when element multiply by it itself then a square is equal to e this give us identity mean inverse of a is a inverse of b is b inverse of c is c so a inverse is equal to b inverse is equal to c inverse is equal to a b inverse is equal to e it means to say that a square is also equal to e b square is equal to e similarly c square and a b square is equal to e so and other condition in this group is when a multiplied by b it give us c or b multiplied by a it give us c it's mean that the other two non identity elements generate the third non identity element where a multiplied by c it give us b or c multiplied by a it give us c b when b multiplied by c it give us a or c multiplied by b it also give us a the order may be changed so let's check its uh, scalar table let's we make it scalar table so the klein 4 group scalar table is a billion when we see that it is a billion i told you later first of all let's have a look at the table when uh, these are in elements of line 4 e a b and c in row and in column a e a b c similarly as we multiply in uh, scalar table of uh, 1 minus 1 iota minus iota similarly this is identity element when identity element multiply by identity give us identity when identity element multiply by a give us a when b is give us b when c it give us c so when a multiply by e when any element multiply by identity then element itself comes when a multiply by a so we have discussed earlier that a into a a square a is self inverse so a square is equal to e when a multiply by b non identity element multiplying then the third element will come they generate third element when a multiply by c a c multiply by, it means it give us the third element b when b multiply by e e the identity element so b comes when b multiply by a b and a it means they will give us c when b multiply by b so it means that b square b is self inverse so b square means it give us identity element and when b multiply by c so b c when both multiply non identity element third non identity element is a so when c multiply by e it give us e uh, sorry it give us c here should be c it give us c so when a c multiply by a it give us b 
and C multiply by B, so C, B are non-identity element and the third non-identity element is A. And when C multiply by C, so C square, C square is identity element. This is very beautiful table. We can see when we cut it from Why, how can how can we see that it is abelian when the curly table of any group we cut by its diagonal it's become mirror diagonal this is the diagonal it become mirror like this side is similarly like this side cc b is here b is here b is here b is here a is here a is here a is here, A is here, and this is the identity element. So, when it show its reflection, it shows that it is an abelian group. Any group you can check by Kelly table like this. So, it is a very beautiful example uh, of Kelly table, uh, Klein 4. So, let's see next, and uh, two properties we will discuss. The Klein 4 group, what are those properties? Let's see. We have earlier discussed about these properties. Every known identity element of order 2. Every element, every known, uh, what are the elements of Klein 4? E, A, B, and C. These are four, uh, four elements. So, uh, non identity elements are A, B, and C. The E is identity element. So, order 2 means that A square give us E as we discussed earlier, B square give us E, C square give us E. So, the power of element is 2. So, order of element is 2. The next condition is any 2 of 3 non identity element. Let me say that A, B. Generate the third one. We have made the table as well. A, B is equal to C and A, C is equal to B. Here the lecture ends. Please subscribe my channel and share my video if you like it. Thank you so much.